After substantial cuts affects the Thanksgiving traditions, the Lighthouse Mission in Terre Haute is now preparing for Christmas. With winter being one of the hardest seasons for the mission, finances have to be closely monitored. News 10's Sarah Schaefer has more on their plans. It hasn't been the smoothest road lately for the Lighthouse Mission. We cut out our insurance, uh, so we have no health insurance today. Uh, we cut salaries uh, by about $167,000 this year. In the last couple of years, a total of about $340,000 or give or take. Those are some of the largest cuts, but along with them is a handful of others, such as their annual Thanksgiving baskets that fed countless families for years. Still, the morale is high. We're good. You know, we, we know this is necessary. You know, our staff has been real good about the cuts that I made. You know, when you start cutting pay and cutting uh, benefits, you know, but they've all stayed. And so, I, and I think they have a heart for the ministry and, and the care for the needy here in the Wabash Valley and the homeless. And the projected budget for the upcoming year, one million and thirty thousand dollars. That's down from about one million three hundred and seventy. <laughs> Fag says the tough part is the need still continues to increase, but they're remaining hopeful for the winter. Uh, there's old song said if we make it through December, <laughs> if we make it through December, January, February, we're going to do good, and uh, I think that uh, things next year is going to look up much better. Predicting that for the new year, they'll be out of the negatives and running financially sound. In Terre Haute with photojournalist Tony Cassasia, I'm Sarah Schaefer, News 10. The Lighthouse Mission is not cutting their annual Christmas dinner this year. It is this Thursday at 6.30 p.m.